Hello everyone, Moose Torrent here, and we got an action-packed video for you today. A lot of people think the tank core is overpowered. They think he's got so much defense. He's even got decent speed. He just drives towards you with his thrusters on, and he just blasts you with guns. He blasts you with grenades. He even rams in you. But he can do absolutely nothing at all against Skywalker. This is a quad build. It loves to fly into the air, hover at the top of the map, and just launch missile after missile after missile. And big heavy guys can do nothing. Unless they have the best generator in the game and maybe overboost effectively. Even then, though, I, I just don't see heavies beating this. Armored Core does kind of have this weird... It's not quite rock, paper, scissors, but there's definitely builds that are just hard counters to other builds that just... I mean, they destroy them. Basically, there's no chance of you winning at all. And, I mean, that's kind of cool, but it's also kind of lame. <laughs> I mean, if you're the type of build that can't do anything against high flyer like this it's not very fun but there's definitely a lot of strategies to beat this we'll see if anyone does it today but overboosting helps a lot you can overboost at this guy shoot him while you're overboosting and then land a kick on him he will fall out of the sky and if i'm on the ground and i overboost away you can overboost and chase me and shoot me in the back um, people have done that before a lot of people, though, just have no idea how to handle this thing. And, well, hopefully they figure it out because uh, I'm, I'm going into the arena today. So we're using the HML G3 P08 SPL 06 Split Missile Launcher. This is a split missile for your hand and is pretty dang good. It's got 1,056 attack power if all of them hit. Same thing on our left hand, so... Both hands, split missiles, and both of our back units are the G2 P05 MLT-10. Launches 10 small missiles, one after the other, in a chain. The best way to use this is to launch all 10, and then launch all 10 of the other one. Not at the same time. You want that string going one after the other, so that way if they dodge a few, the string is still chasing them. And then if they do get hit and they get staggered, the whole string will end up hitting them. It's pretty nice. So you want to space out your missiles as much as you can. Our head is the Basho. It only has 95 energy load, which is great, so it can stay in the air longer. The VE-40A core is a pretty dang good core. It's a heavyweight, so we're having some decent defense, but it also has 122 generator output adjust so we can stay in the air longer with that. Uh, the booster efficiency is only 81, but I find that the generator output is pretty dang good for what we're trying to do. We also have the Basho arms, which are great because they only have 210 energy load. They look like a missile type arm, right? I don't know. The legs are the Veril. These are the tetrapod quadriceps legs. They allow you to hit X when you're in the air to hover, and you can just stay at that level hover around launch your missiles great the booster is the po6 spd designed for speed in terms of thrust not the best quick boost but since we're not quick boosting a lot we're just hovering around this is probably our best bet fcs is uh fcs g2 p10 slt what's great about this one is the missile lock correction is 150 very good and our generator is the Santai. it has a huge energy capacity of 4420 giving us a huge energy bar so we can stay hovering for a long time and we got pulse armor it pulses all right well let's get started with the pvp A tank! Wow. 
so you guys can see the full power of Skywalker on display. He's a complete hard counter against tanks. They just do not have the boost power to deal with him. Where is he? I... Oh, he's underneath me. Stealth tank. See how he's just taking all those hits. And he's trying. Looks like we're going to run out of energy before we kill him, though. That'll be interesting. Let's see if I can stun him again, and I can drop. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Run! This is pretty intense. I mean, it wasn't really close at all, but I was scared when I dropped to the ground. <laughs> Looks like Gatling guns, songbirds, and maybe a shield. I think we can get this guy, but he does seem to have some mobility. So we'll see. Flying in the rain tonight. Oh, look at him. He is in the sky. Let's see how long he can stay up there. Okay, did hit him with some missiles. A lot of them missed. That is why they're called missiles, after all, because they miss so much. He is staying away. Here he is! Oh, a big grenade to the core. Sorry to stagger him though. There we go, the aerial stagger. Let's see if we can kill him before we fall to the ground. No, we cannot! It's gonna be close. Wow, got him. 14001. Flamer and a shotgun, but on a heavy. Well, heavy legs, light core, light arms, medium light head. So, let's see how much mobility he has. He's taken to the sky. He's already fallen to the ground. The flamethrower actually has a longer reach than I was expecting it to have. He's not deterred though, look at him. He's going in. He's got a lot of defense. But we definitely, I think, have the advantage. Yeah, I don't think he's going to make it. So many missiles. So little time. Oh! All right, this guy wanted a rematch. He switched up his gear. Let's see if he's got anything better for taking down an aerial opponent. Okay, he's up there. He's, he is flying, that's for sure. Ooh, I think he's hitting me more. Get those 10 launches. Whoa! Oh, the laser's so big. But I'm about to stagger him. I'm about to stagger him. Oh, God. Yeah, we got the stagger. Fall out of the sky, please. No, he's not falling. Uh. Ow. I'm doing fine, actually. He was really close, though. He just could not maintain the aerial as I can. Oh, no. He's got 10 launch missiles, a shotgun, and a laser blade. This one can go either way, man. I don't know. 
I'm gonna try to make him lose his footing here. I actually stunned him. A lot of good it's doing me. Around the corner like that. He's taking damage. I'm going to take a little pit stop or generate some energy. I did not do very much damage there. Playing hide and seek with me. I gotta be careful not to get stunned in the air. If I do, I will fall to my death. It will allow me, however, to keep him away from me. Oh no, he's coming in! He's coming in! Oh, I thought he was going to fall off the cliff. That was a whiff on a kick. Plus he was shielded anyways. But the missiles got him from the ground. That was a fun match. See him. Alright, he's taking damage at the start here. We're taking some damage from his 10 launch. We staggered him. Okay, our stagger is going to go away. Oh, he's coming in. Shield! Where'd he go? Gotta get over the land before I run out of energy. Okay, we'll drop. Oh, landed on a pillar. Didn't even do it on purpose. I mean, I did that on purpose. I'm a master of my surroundings. I know where I am at all times. Trying to do some ground evasion and it was working pretty good there. Ow, 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 ow. That is the power of the 10. Oh! <laughs> Gave up. It kind of sucks when you're against a build and you just cannot do anything against them. I think he had a chance though if you played it a little differently. He's got a punch, two missiles. He's got a punch. I'm going to have to be ready to kick. Might be trying to do some close quarters combat shenanigans. Might be hiding on this tower. Trying to hit me. Oh, there's a kick already. Yeah, that was definitely some shenanigans. He ran out of energy though, we gotta press the attack. Oh, get him while he's gonna fall. No, oh, he didn't fall. Stagger him, yes. That close quarters attack really did some damage to me. Gotta stay away. Oh, I kicked him. Spider spin kick for the win. Kicked him again! Got him! Wow, what a match! Almost dead! Oh, and he falls! <laughs> I love that. Missiles, grenades, laser lance, and an unknown on reverse joints. I don't know, this could be a close one. Get up top here. Get a nice boost. 
see him. Does he see me? I don't think so. He's going the wrong way. He's got to know where I am now. Blasting him with missiles. Oh, he's got missiles of his own. Launching his shield already. Did not want to get that early stagger. He's about to take one, though. There it is. Doesn't mean too much for me. I don't get much extra damage from a stagger, but I do get to escape. Oh, I was trying to kick. And he locked himself into the twin laser blade. Ooh, a heavy twin Gatling laser shotgun. Looks like needle cannon. If I can avoid getting hit, I should have the advantage here against the heavy. Let's see if we can start our salvo. Launching missiles from the air. Bombing run commenced. Target taking heavy damage. Oh, he's trying to hit me with those gas, but he is staggered. He's too heavy to move. I really am the heavy killer. But the thing about heavies, though, is they have a lot of HP. And that means they survive long enough for me to have to drop to the ground. Although on this stage, I could try to find a building... Like this. And then, wow. Dude, city OP. Oh, he avoided all that with his fat speed. Beefy boy's got moves. Okay, we got him though. He, he doesn't have that much in terms of moves. <laughs> Another heavy tanker. Let's get to the top of one of these buildings and launch into the sky. Let's be another cathartic match for those of you who've been beaten down by the tank. If we can find him, that is. Found him. Yeah, he is not liking that. He's trying to get on top of a building, it looked like. Yeah, he cannot do anything. <laughs> wow, almost instantly stunned me. Those needlers. The needle cannon's not bad. Oh no. I'm about to... Run out of energy and drop. Hopefully not to my death. Yes, we got the stun, though. And we run! That was a perfect time stun. I didn't even really time it. I just got lucky that the stun was at the moment I ran out of energy. He was trying to overboost in. <laughs> oh, my God. He get laser lanced. <laughs> Close some distance, he's doing some damage. We kicked him. Finished him off. Not necessarily on the ground, but we were not hovering above the map anymore. A lightweight build. Double grenades on the back. A shotgun moonlight. I don't know, guys. He could be the one that takes me down. He has the light weight. Okay, I see him in the distance. Ooh. Moving fast. He's coming in hot. Gotta launch everything we've got at him. Got a lot of stagger built up. Oh, 
don't know how these buildings are going to come into play. Glad that freaking grenade missed, though. Oh, the moonlight to the face! Ooh. Oh, wow! I didn't know I did that much damage to him. That's it for this job, 621. Return to base. This is Moose Torrent. And I'll be back with another video for you guys shortly.